What's going on YouTube? Trucking the life here. One more time. Man, your boy did the dummy today, man. I, I'm glad I was able to fix it and recover. But as you can see, as you can see guys, I'm on a, I'm on the regular street. You'll see in this video on this clip, I'm gonna show you. I'm on the street. I ain't in no parking lot. I ain't in no real yard. It's all on me. All, I'm out here in the public. And I hit the brakes, I use the trailer brakes. You know, sometimes you use the trailer brakes to stop. You're the kind of save on your brakes, you know what I'm saying? Especially if you're on up, you know, you want to save your brakes. So I was using the trailer brakes coming through the city. And uh, so this area I'm at right now is in the city. So man, I'm glad I was in the city, guys, when I hit the brakes, man. Because if I did, if I was on an expressway or something, and I slid it hard enough to stop, or well, I had to come off with an off ramp, who knows what, what would happen. But anyway, check it out. I'm going to show you guys. I already slid the tail on this back right, but I'm going to show you what to watch out for to make sure the thing is locked, guys. Mine slid hard. I thought it would come off the rail, but it didn't. I was doing about 35 miles per hour. That's fast enough for some brute force, to, for, for some, man, you know, you know. But anyway, I right, too. stay tuned. You see the neighborhood, right? My neighborhood, guys, hey. Yo, your boy, I did the dummy, man, look. I got a, I got a 53 footer today, right? I was coming to this light right here, guys. And, you know, in the rail yard, it was locked in, but it was like way back to the back. You know, we got the bridge law in Illinois, so, you know, we can't ride all the way to the back, you know, for other reasons. But, so I slid it forward to the eight to 10 hole mark on here for in the rail yard. And I did a tug test and I thought that pin was in, guys. But it wasn't in. So I used my trailer brush at this light right here. Auto hurts. Boom. This thing slid all the way back, man. Now I'm glad it didn't fly off because sometimes you hit enough power, enough brute force, that stopper down there. I seen these things come clean off of here. And this load's super heavy, guys. So what I'm saying is, man, I don't care how long you've been doing this. How long you think you good? How much you think you got it? Man, I did a tug test. I thought it was locked. It wasn't. I'm glad it didn't fly off, guys, because I was going, I was going about 35 miles per hour on the street right here. And uh it slid way back, guys, and it hit that real hard, man. So I pulled over right here at the light over here. So I put over to the light, guys, to make sure I slid it. And that landing gear, that, that, that handle you pull, it's a little messed up. So you want to make sure. I had to literally use some brute force and also use my foot and push it in that guys because now imagine I'm in mean, on the real y'all I'm on the street guys. I'm on the street right now. So anyway, I had to manually push it in, slid the tandles back a little bit to line up the hole, and then literally to take my foot and push it in guys manually. I had to go back there and visually check because last time I did a tug test, it was it was grabbing, but it was only it was only grabbing a little bit. Alright you too. So remember I told you guys earlier I showed the video I showed you before the video about me um these guys trying to back in over here guys it's like it's not a lot of room man it's trucks all over the place but I gotta back in over here but the video ain't about this I wanted to show you guys when I showed you guys that the channels already already showed you they already already had slid them I was already fighting with it on the street but I wanna show you I'm gonna slide it here but before, uh to show you guys that the pin it won't lock in all the time so just you gotta manually push it in guys you gotta line the holes up manually push it in that's why I slid like that when I used the trailer brake and it slid all the way back. I thought it was locked in, but it wasn't. The spring sometimes be messed up. But anyway, I got a bigger issue. I gotta make sure this customer here, they want the bill of laden, guys. But I gotta open up the back. Hopefully it's back there. If it's not, I might need to go to a truck stop and get it printed out because I ain't gonna print it on my truck. Or I gotta have them email it on the bill if they take it. But anyway, if we go back here and see it, guys, if it's back here, if it is, I'm gonna get the bill. Then I'm gonna show you guys me sliding the tandems and show you how the pin sometimes don't wanna lock. Anyway, I right, guys, let's go. And while I'm back here too, I'm, I'm opening open the doors and leave them open. You know, it don't make no sense to uh, so they lock now. But like I said, I had to kick it close. I had to use some brute force. But anyway, let me open this right quick. Hopefully, the bill back here, man. I'm hoping it is. You see, his trucks out on the street. It's not out of place to park around here. He just pulled up the dock. That guy pulled up. Anyway, it ain't about that. Wiggling back and forth, but sometimes it'll work. Can you see? Look, see it? So, sometimes the bill be back here on one of these roads, man, but I don't see it back here. Man, 
And you see guys, this is a 53 footer today, man. Heavy rolls, man, heavy rolls. But anyway, guys, I gotta uh, try to get the bill in over there. But anyway, the video ain't about that, I'll do that in a minute. Right now, I wanna make sure. Okay. All right, that ain't back here. All right, guys, so I'm gonna I'm straighten out, then I'm gonna slide my tail, I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about. How that thing won't lock. Sometimes you gotta make sure that thing is locked, guys. Like I showed you earlier on the street. Man, use your trailer brake and it, and it slide back like that. With a heavy load like this, I'm surprised it didn't come off the rails, but I'm glad it didn't, though. But anyway, so now I'm gonna pull it. It's in. Hold on. Pull it. And this is one way you could tell. This is one way you could tell when the springs is not that good, guys. See, look. You see, it's like a little lip right here, right? This is supposed to catch this. But look at this. It ain't even. It ain't even, uh, when you pull it out like this, it's supposed to bounce back in like this. So look, watch this. See? See how it bounced in a little bit? It's supposed to come out like that. So when it don't come out like that, it means the spring probably bad on the inside of here, inside of there, but it's all right. It lets you know that when you slide your tans and lock them in place, make sure that, that, that uh, the pin is in the hole. But anyway, let me slide this out, guys. See, I got it in there, it ain't all the way in there, but I got it in there somewhere, not finna slide it, guys. All right, guys, so now I'm finna straighten out. You see I'm kind of crooked, so I'm finna straighten out before I slide my tandems. There's one of them dots you gotta slide your tandems before you go into the door anyway, so. But I couldn't ride up here like that because of bridge laws, but anyway. Plus, besides the bridge law, I'd be overweight on certain axles anyway, so, you know. Some slide back. Back up a little bit. Get a little straight. I'm gonna slide that joint on back, you know what I'm talking about? Anyway, here we go. Alright, I'm off. Alright, now I'm straight. Now watch this. I'm finna slide them back now. Gotta watch. Just slide them back right now. Holding my, I'm holding my trailer brake. Oh, you can set the trailer brakes. I'm going for a little bit. There we go. You see it sliding? See how I did that? Real hard, real soft. I did that super hard when I was rolling down the road, guys. But anyway. Alright, now usually I don't lock my stuff when I back into the dock, guys. Like I said, when I get out, I slide it back. But for this video, you see, I'm still all the way back. That's how it was on the street. Watch this. See how the hole is kind of messed? It's kind of off a little bit. Now, when you do that, this spring right here is supposed to go all the way in. And then I can back up a little bit and it's a, oh, it's a uh, lock in. But you can see the spring messed up. So it won't lock automatically, guys. So sometimes you got to line the holes up good and then just push it in manually. What I usually do, matter of fact, I don't even feel like going through all this, guys. I'm going to be honest with you, man. So I'm going to show you this. Hope you get the drift. What I'm gonna do is, if I slid this back forward, you know I might short when I, you know what guys, skip that man, I ain't gonna short, I ain't gonna short change this. When I get loaded, I put out the dot guys, you see it slid all the way back, right? As a matter of fact, uh, I'm gonna leave this in. And uh, usually, when I'm about to uh, lock this back in place, I would, uh, this is what I would do, check it out. All right, stop being lazy, I'm gonna stop being lazy. I hold on to this right here, take my foot, like this, and push it in. And sometimes it's going a little further. But anyway, I ain't gonna lock that when I'm in the back of the dock, guys. I'm gonna wait till I pull out and I'm gonna show you guys me sliding it back in place and then locking it, guys. All right, guys, stay tuned. All right, hold on, here we go. Now, I was gonna swing it out, guys, but I don't know, something, something else going on right here right now. Hey, how you doing, man? Yeah, they, they yeah, I'm getting unloaded. Okay. Yeah, yeah, I'm rolled. Sorry, I'm you want to pick up. Oh, no, no, no. I'll be out your way. Oh, no, you okay? You blocking the door? Yeah, you ain't blocking the door. You okay? All right, thank you, bro. All right, guys, so what I'm going to do is, uh, he thought I was picking up. I guess it's delivery, it's delivery, though. I don't know. Anyway. 
Now, if you do it, watch these cars right here, guys, when you do it. So I'm gonna swing out to the right here. Now, you okay? I gotta go in there, guys. He ain't in the way. And then I'm going to, uh, it might be easier for me blindside though, to be honest with myself. Nope. I ain't better make it. I got a blind side, guys. It ain't gonna work. But this stuff is in the way. Let her go by. Avery getting out the way. So now I can go back some more. And then, uh, try to do it again. Shall we? Oh, yeah. There we go. Trail over there. Trailer should, should be going to that door right there. Uh huh. I'm in a bad position right now, but it's all right. Driver gave me a little aid and assist. Oh yeah, you gotta use some help. Ain't never too good for help, baby. Oh yeah. She should be lined up right now. Yeah, I can't hardly see nothing though. Oh yeah, I can't see nothing though, man. What the heck? Yeah, she's lined up right now. All right, I can see. I think I can see the door right there. Oh yeah, I see it. I was back close to the side you can see guys. I can see this side. So now I turned it to a side side now. I'm back real close to the yellow pole because there's a trail on the side of me. And I'm watching the overhead door too while I'm doing it. And I can see the dock. I can see the dock back there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's money right there, baby. Oh, that's good money right there, baby. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's money. Oh yeah. Y'all can back in. Now I'm a little crooked, but it's all right. Back it slow. I'm not sure what's in there. I think it's some poles and I should have looked in there. I'm completely blind right now. I can't see nothing right now. Oh, there we go. I think I'm lined up. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I think I'm a little off. Just a little bit off. At least I ain't hitting that trailer. I ain't hitting nothing in the dock. Oh yeah, let's go. Oh yeah. Uh-huh. Usually you get out and look guys, but I think I'm okay. I, I had a glance at the I can't see nothing. Oh yeah, I think I'm straight. I think I'm straight. Yeah, I think it's lined up with the dock right there. I think it's lined up. So I'll get inside the dock, I can see a lot better. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, there we go, man. Good deal. And the pole on the side. I didn't even see that pole. Uh oh, is that it? This ain't just, just, just a little flavor to the video, guys. Let's see how let's see how it look, guys. Let's see. Oh yeah. That's how it look good. That's how it look. Oh yeah. See, I ain't even see this pole in here, man. So I back to the side, the closest side I could see, and it looked pretty good to me. But anyway, the video about this guy's got a little flavor to it. Yeah, I'm, I'm okay. Yeah, I'm okay. And this trailer right here too, see somebody kind of, you know, did their thing on that. Anyway, but this is blocking anyway, but yeah, I'm glad I can hit this. Yeah, man. Should be okay. Let me go back and verify this. Make sure it's... Even oh yeah, we straight. This thing right here, the dough, the dumper, the bu the bump, the what you call that thing? 
the dock bumper is right here on the ground. So, oh yeah, we straight, man. We good, guys. Anyway, guys, all right, guys. See you guys when we out when I start the cameras back and the video, guys. All right, YouTube, I'm done. Feel ready to pull out now. As soon as the guy get out of the way, I pull over there somewhere. Yeah, I'm gonna slide these tandems, guys. I'm gonna show you how to, you know, sometimes it don't lock, and I'm in the video, guys. All right, guys, stay tuned. All right, YouTube, now see, it's in between, right? Now, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna push this over here. This is kind of weird, you know, when I push this over, this is supposed to pop in. And when I slide the tandems for it's supposed to slide in the hole, but watch this. It ain't going in. See, it's still sitting out. See it? So what I'm going to do is, because it ain't the spring messed up on the inside, I'm going to kick it with my foot. Like this. And push it in. So I'm going to slide it back and it should pop in, guys. Let's see. Uh, you see, it's, it's kind of in, but it ain't all the way out, guys. If I was to pull to a light, that'd still slide, because it ain't all the way in there like that. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to try to put, take my foot, push this in some more. Sometimes I can push it out. If not, what I'm going to do, see? See it? Now you guys see it's out now, see? Because this got to go in because the spring messed up. So that's what happens guys, when uh, the spring messed up, this thing don't pop all the way out. You think it's locked, it's like it catches a little bit on the lip, but it ain't all the way caught. And sometimes you hit the brakes of the light like I did earlier today, it'll slide all the way back, man. I just seen these things come off of here before. And I'm glad Madden didn't come off, guys. But anyway, it happened. So this side is out. Now I'm